Kelly. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to go O style with a Glam Planner kit from back in the day. It is a Hello Fall kit, which is perfect because this is the first day of fall. Now it is the Sunday before. I'm actually getting my planning done a day early, but it probably won't get edited and put up until actually um, Plan With Me Monday time, which will be perfect. And so I went ahead and and so I went ahead and pulled out some different washi that I felt like really went with this kit very well. I want to do a flag banner um, with washi tape like I've done in the past. It's usually really um, time consuming, but I thought, well, I can speed through that part. So that's what I'm gonna do. I just went ahead and looked through my stash and I pulled out the ones that I felt like matched best with the colors that I'm working with. I found obviously some Simply Gilded. So I have um, all the bow washi obviously are Simply Gilded. Then um, the solid gold metallic, this one, this one, those two, those three are um, Michaels and a tube, one of those tubes or whatever. And then um, this one is the wood grain. I'm not sure where that one came from. I think it just came off of um, Etsy. Not really sure where this one come from, but I think Target because it's a scotch. But I think I found that at Target. And then this one um, is part of a kit and it's, um, well, I say a kit. It's part of a scrapbook collection. Um, if I can remember or find the name, I will put that on the screen right now, but it's just a floral with this pretty green background, and I thought maybe I might could get it to match. So, I'm gonna go ahead and get started by using the washi, which is matte here. I'm gonna go ahead and use it, and I'm gonna trim it down and put some, um, Let's see, what do I wanna do? I think I'm gonna go with the peachy color because that'll stand out most against this darker background. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and do the bottom washi. And yeah, let's get started. Let's do what we can. And I'm excited to really plan for you guys. I have a sinus situation going on. I'm not really sure, you know guys, this is my first like, I was down here um, in late September last year, but not at the turn of time when um, a lot of this stuff was going on. And the time that I was down here, I wasn't yet spending any time outdoors because I was so busy trying to get settled. So it, I don't really know what's blooming down here, but I do remember last year that I suffered a lot with goldenrod. I am allergic to goldenrod and I'm also allergic to ragweed. And I've had people tell me that ragweed is really bad down here. Um, so I'm allergic to what they call giant ragweed. I don't really know what the difference is, but yeah, I, I'm really allergic to it. I had, well, I used to take allergy shots and um, that was one of the things that they said that I was allergic to. I'm also allergic to elm trees, which is kind of crazy. There's a lot more down here of the um, outdoorsy kind of situation, I guess you could say, because, um, you know, there's a lot of woods and trees. I'm trying to find my ruler here. But there's a lot of trees and plants. That, I mean, you know, it's just, it's, it's very rural in a lot of places because you're near the beach and you just have more um, places to, let me see if I can pull that up just a little bit. But, um, you know, there's just more places to, come in contact with the elements. Now what I'm gonna do, because this did not come with um, any, actually I did not cut straight either. Oh, that's not good. Let me see if I can fix that. I'm gonna try to remedy that. I'm gonna try to cut off a bit of it and see can I get it straight. Okay, I was able to get that straight. Now the issue is going to be getting this. I was going to use what's left over as my date covers. I'm going to put down the straight side and then trim it down some so that it does not have this little wave action going here. <laughs> So anyway, yeah, allergy season has started and it's just been kind of crazy so far. Let me see, can I straighten this? Guys, what you're seeing right now is just me kind of on the fly trying to figure out 
what's best for making do when you don't have any date covers. And I, I looked through my collection and I just did, I just don't have any that are, you know, of this color um, scheme. I, I didn't have any that would, that were even close. Um, that's the one thing I'm All really right, you can see that it did not exactly go down straight. I couldn't get it terribly straight because I was having to cut such teeny tiny little areas. But I think overall it'll be okay. I did go ahead and wipe this out. It's kind of um, not so good. And of course, I have red marks from my fingernails. I don't understand how that happens, guys. I really don't. <laughs> I mean, I have, you know, like a top coat on my nails. So I have no idea how or why that happens. But it does. And so I'm going to have to try and be as careful as possible to keep it from happening much. I just don't want a whole bunch of red marks everywhere because you can't always cover them up. So... Let me go in with this next piece of washi and trim it off, and I'll be right back. I went ahead and put my flags on the sides that I made out of a washi strip from the washi um, page, and I was able to finish up my bottom washies. I think it looks really good so far. I'm really, really pleased. Okay, before I go any further, I am going to be using, I pulled these from my stash. They're just some Scribble Prints Co. Um, glitter headers. I didn't want to use the written ones. I decided that I wanted to go with these. I'm going to be using um, the green at the top. I think I'm going to go with this lighter green. Actually, that green would probably go too. Let me see. Actually, the darker green probably goes with the colors that I pulled out best. Yes, I'll just go ahead and go with these. Um, now, my idea for the um, weekend banner that I'm going to make with my washi tapes like Nikki plus three and several others do. Um, my idea for this that I'm going to do today comes from, I follow her on Instagram. Her account is, um, somebody anxiously plans. I'll put it on the screen so you guys know what I'm talking about. But anyway, she has some really cool weekend banners and this one that I'm doing is inspired by one that she did just recently. I thought it was really cute, really pretty, and I wanted to um, try my hand at it myself. And so um, that's where I got the idea. And she does them different um, each week. I, I mean, well, she does them, they're similar, but she does just a little something different each week. And I just really, really liked the one from week before last that she put down. So that's the one that I've chosen to, to do today um, where you go ahead and you put down your headers and then you're gonna put down a strip of your choice of washi and then you um, do the flags underneath that really. Actually, I guess I need to do the flags and then the strip of washi underneath here. Um, but it just turns out to look really cute. And then she used, obviously, a um, weekend banner across the top of it. It turns out just really, really cute. So I thought that it would be a great way to incorporate some of these washi that I have. And I'm not really sure. I, I know that I want to do this one. And I know I want to use this one. And obviously, I'm going to accent with this one. Um, the rest of them... I'm not really sure how I want to do it. I need some varying sizes. I think I'm gonna try to do a combination of these. I think that's what I wanna do. Let me do, I do still have this one though and it's really pretty, but I think I'm gonna use this one across the top and I'll use the, mm, do I wanna do that? I think I may use, let's use this one across the top. I think it'll be fine. And I'm gonna make some flags out of some of the actual washi strips from the kit. Right. So since I'm gonna use the floral at the t across the top, I did one. I went ahead and put some white out there. I'm gonna go ahead and get started with. I definitely want to use the wood grain just because it's something different um, and unexpected. I hope I'm able to do this the way that she does it because I mean it's just so dang cute when she does it. So let's go ahead and get this one on. I think I'm gonna put this one on the side. 
on the outside edge if I can flag it. But what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna flag these and layer them. I'm gonna go do these off of the camera because it's kind of hard to place them. Just like that right there. And then I'll trim them off and I'll come back after I've got my placement just right. It takes me forever to do these guys. I mean, forever. Anyway, I, I put my flags down. I used some of the washi strips here and here and then just some actual washi in other places. Now I'm gonna go in with this floral and I'm gonna layer it on top and that's where I'm gonna put my banner for the most part. Um, but this is the best that I can come up with that I saw she did. Um, hers, obviously, she's probably had a lot more practice than me <laughs> because I, I rarely do this. For me, it's just really not worth the time and effort that it takes to do it. Um, but I really was inspired when I saw hers and decided to try it. So that's what we're doing. Now I'm going to go in with the weekend banner that I feel like is going to show up the most, which is going to be this one. That, um, I'm bouncing everything. The, um, glitter, it does not seem to stick very well on that, but I'm hoping that it'll stick enough that it won't make too much of a difference. But I just want as much of this to show as possible. Uh, let's see. I could do it like this and that way. Let's see. I don't want to do this. I can't remember how she did it. It seems like she did it down here. Um, I'm going to put it like this right here. That way there's not as much darkness underneath this tape. Let's see how it's turned out. So this is along the lines of what she did. I think it's really, really cute. Um, yeah, it's really cute. I don't know if it's really necessarily worth the effort if you're just trying to plan normally, but this week for me is going to be, I would say pretty, um, more decorative than functional. How, how about that? So, um, yeah, it, I'm just going to do something that's kind of straightforward. Um, I'm not going to really, you know, do anything hard. I just don't really have a lot going on this week. And so, like I said, more decorative than functional. Um, I think it's worth it to do a banner like that, especially when you're really into the heavily decorated side. Because I just think it is really a pretty statement for the week. It's, it's very, very pretty. So, yeah, um, I am going to put, um, I need to decide how I want to do these. Sorry about that, guys. I had to cough. My head feels like it's just going to explode. Okay, I could put um, the, yeah, I, I could put checklists here, but I don't think I really need checklists for this weekend, so I'm going to leave them off. Um, and I do, that gives me one more for the sidebar. So let's go ahead and look at what we have for, um, this week as far as full boxes are concerned and headers. I think I want to go with, on top of the headers, I want to go with the, what color? Do, yes. I want to go in with this color that I have here on this sheet. These are just, um, from Scribble Prints Co. And... They're really old. Um, she doesn't do these anymore, but I had picked up a full set of these. And as you know, I've been reorganizing my sticker collection and I have been trying to go through and use up as much stuff as I possibly can. And so, yeah, this was the perfect kit since her old kits don't have as many items in them as what the um, kits do nowadays. I thought, well, you know what? I'm gonna use those. Um, I could always use the words that came with them, but I think these are just prettier. So that's what I decided to go with. And you know, I'll stick those headers in my binder where I have extra headers at. And if I ever have a need for one in that color or whatever, then I have it. Other than that, I'm just gonna go with this on here and enjoy the look of the glitter header. I think it's really pretty. I'll use the last one on the sidebar, most likely. 
I'm not really sure how I'm gonna do the sidebar. I think this is looking really good, guys. I love the, see all that foil? And that foil goodness is pretty. It's really, really pretty. Okay, I am liking what I'm doing so far. All right, let's go in and decide. Um, let me put these to the side and decide what I'm gonna do with, I've got these and then I've got to do, um, yeah, there's not any icons or anything here. So I'm gonna need to go into my collection a lot. Uh, yeah, I'll end up going into my collection a good bit because I don't really have anything for the, side, for the sidebar, but I'm okay with that. Okay, I'm gonna go in with Hello Fall because this is the first week of fall. This is the first day of fall. And um, it's kinda neat that it's starting on a Monday. Gets us all started off just right. And now I'm just gonna go in and I'm gonna place these where I think they need to go. I'm going to put this beautiful deer in the middle. Let me go ahead and open this up a little bit. I'm gonna put this in, just like that. She's really cute. And I want to distribute these out so that they're not, you know, near, um, let's do this one here. So they're not near each other. I wanna have them kind of spaced out if possible. So, yeah, let's see here. Let's go in with this one. No, 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 no. Let's go in with this one because I don't want these side by side. That would not make me happy. I would end up pulling it up and re rearranging it. So might as well do it this way the first time. Mm, yeah, I'm gonna go with the smaller print on this one. And this, ha I have large print, small print, large print, more small print. So yeah, that's the way that I'm gonna kinda do things here. All right, let's go in with the same order and I'll put the last dark background on the Sunday and that will have it spaced out enough for me that I feel good about it being, or having that even look about it. So that's one empty sheet that I didn't have. Okay, and then I had another um, glitter set that came with a kit. I believe this was a Halloween kit, if I'm not mistaken. But this color, I thought it went really well. It's hard, this is actually a, a navy, I think, but because there's that dark in that, I think it'll be okay. All right, so let's go ahead and let me go in and get my, that's really crooked. Let me go get my headers in and we'll go from there. What I have done, um, I did go ahead and get my headers in across here. I had this set of date covers left over from um, a kit from Sassy Apple Studio and they are this peachy color. And so I thought they, since they are in the white background, I thought they'd stand out really well and look really good. And so I just used those to put down my date. So now um, I'm saving myself from any ugly handwriting. <laughs> okay, it's time to go in and look at the sidebar. I'm really not sure what I'm gonna do with the sidebar. Um, there are only um, five on the checklist here. So I guess I could probably use that as my YouTube and she does have a YouTube sticker. So let's just go ahead and do that. And I do want to use, let's see, do I have an extra? I think I did have another. I had another one of these left over in this color. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that at the top. Just like that. And then I'll put in my YouTube. Not straight though. <laughs> Would you guys tell me, do you enjoy when I do these Use It Up series? Because I don't really know what to think. You know, I'm not really sure if, um, let's see, I'm trying to find something that, that I can use for dinners. Uh, 
How about we go with family? Because I used that one time before and it worked out okay. So let me go ahead and use that. I'm probably not gonna have any other um, like trackers or anything this week just because I don't think I have anything in the color scheme here that it you know would work. But I am gonna do um, my five meals for the week, Monday through Friday. And then Saturday and Sunday have become days where we don't really track all the time. I do some weeks, it just depends, but overall I've got to where I just really don't track much. Okay, um, I'm going to stop there for the sidebar at the moment. Now I wanna go into um, my day to day and kind of put in sort of what's going on. Since I don't really have that many icons here, I'm gonna use what I can on these and then I will come back later and um, add as I can from my collection. So let's go ahead and get started here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and, let's see, let me put in my, um, I'm gonna put in this one for my YouTube. This is gonna be my plan with me Monday. So this will go up tomorrow and, um, I want to use, I think I want to use this little cup here for my Coffee Monday. So let me find Coffee Monday in my, this is my thing here. Let's see, it's at the very front. So I'm just gonna pull that and the half week spread out. So let's go in with Coffee Monday. I'm gonna put that across here. I'm gonna just have a very laid back week, guys. I'm not planning on doing anything much, really, I'm not, okay? Let's put this here. I'm just gonna put it right there. Just as a little added something on the checklist there. And I'm gonna go in with half week spread on this day, but I want to put down a piece of washi first. I think I'm going to use this piece just to add some color and to remind me to post on Instagram. I think I made one post this week and I ended up deleting it. Guys, my favorite, 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 all time favorite um, makeup brush is the It Cosmetics Love is the Foundation. Well, I literally look forward every year to the new release and, you know, I, I'm just like, I've got to get to Ulta and I've got to get the brush. It's just that, it's just that inside me that I'm just like, I think about it because I don't want to miss out. So I went in store and didn't see it, but I saw Trend Mood and Kathleen both, Kathleen Lights that is, they both said something about I need to put down, um, I have an appointment this week, so I need to find a color that will match. They mentioned um, that it had restocked, and I was like, okay, well, it's obviously online only, and I'm okay with that. I think I'm gonna use this bright color because it's pretty. And um, so, yeah, uh, I went online when it had been restocked. I made a post about it for you guys to remember to go out and get it and all that kind of stuff. And then I saw Kathleen Lights had posted last night or during the day yesterday on her Insta stories that they changed the brush, guys. They changed it. And I am so completely disappointed in It Cosmetics. I think that she has sold, um, the CEO, I think they've sold It Cosmetics. I don't think that's easy. She's whining because my parents just came home. So anyway, if they changed the brush, it's flat top now instead of that rounded and I don't like a flat top near as much. I'm so disappointed, and I'm probably gonna end up returning it. It's just not gonna be worth the $30 for me to keep it, because um, I know I'm gonna be disappointed. So yeah, I just, I don't know guys, I was I was just really down about that. And it it's sucks. now later in the day. I had to take a break, stop. It was too much noise, too much dog barking. Yeah, so what I went ahead and did is I pulled together some stickers that I'm gonna use for the rest of planning, and we'll just go from there. Um, I was just finishing up putting these stickers down here, and 
I'm gonna have to jump around a good bit um, just to go through these stickers and put down what I want down, but I figured that it might be easier to do it that way than it would be to um, try to shuffle it the whole time. I did have these habit trackers that I found in my stash, and so I'm gonna use one of these over here on the sidebar. And um, so I'm gonna put it down. The color matched decently. And I do have, I believe, another, I do believe that I have another, yes, I do. I have another header here um, that matched these, another glitter header, so. Actually, I guess I'll have to, I don't have much room to work, guys. I don't have much room at all. So I'm just gonna put this last header and that color down and this under it. And then I'm just gonna uh, probably find some sort of uh, deco to use there because I do have the deco here on the deco sheet. So I'll put something underneath there for that. Now, um, yeah, let's go through um, these stickers and put down what we need to put down. Um, the first thing that I want to do is I do want to use um, this from the Plengineer that just says plan. And then, uh, let's see, I'm going to probably do the same again um, on Sunday of next, of this coming week, so or of this week. So let me go ahead and put this in at the bottom, just like that and another plan word. That way, if I'm able to do my plan with me Monday, um, on Sunday, go ahead and get it at least filmed. I can edit and upload on Monday. It'll just get me a day ahead. So I'm gonna go with that. Then the next thing that I had that I wanted to include, um, I have to, on Monday, I need to go to the bank and um, deal with some banking business. I mean, they have messed my account up, something serious, and so I'm gonna go and do that. I had these little uh, bank stickers. I have no idea where they're from. It was like three of them on a little um, strip or whatever, or four of them on a strip. And so I'm just going to put that down. I think I will use, um, well, I may just use some washi for that. Yeah, let's use this one. Um, but I've got to go deal with some banking business because they are confusing my account with my parents' account and it's just become a mess. That is really not terribly straight there, is it? But anyway, um, I'm just gonna put it here on this side, like that right there. But I thought that was really cute and hey, I mean, you know, that uses a, a sticker that wasn't otherwise being used. So there's that. Now, um, some of the other things that I had here, I have some stuff for this weekend. So this is Saturday game day, and you guys know that I like to mark that with my Sassy Apple football stickers. So I'm gonna pull one of those. And I also took the leftover checklist that I had here You'll notice that at the top and the bottom is exactly the same, and so I have to split this. So I'm gonna use the, um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use half of it on Saturday, and then half of it on, um, I'll tell you what, I think I might, how do I wanna do this? I want to have a bit of, Let's see, I, I mean, I guess I could put it on Sunday. I mean, it's gonna be the same, really, regardless of what day I put it on. Um, I just don't, this is, it doesn't look like it's been cut very straight, but I think I'm gonna, let me put it like this, and that'll give me a short checklist so that basically I can get these things done over the weekend, as long as they're done before I go to bed on Sunday night, then we're good. Let me adjust that so it's not quite as crooked looking. Okay, and this is for the game on Saturday. I'm gonna go ahead and put that there. That way I can record that. So I have to do it like this. I'll, um, 
I'll just be happy with it like that right there. Um, I think it's gonna be okay. It's gonna give me a couple things that I can actually write in and I should be fine. I, I think it'll be okay, but that empties up yet another sheet. And I mean, you know, I'm sure I'll find something that I need to do with it anyway. Okay, I also am gonna use, this is from um, my newest addiction. I'm gonna be doing some editing and um, probably, well, I don't know if I wanna do it, yeah, I'm gonna do it Friday. So I'm gonna be doing some editing and I'm gonna to try to film a couple of beauty videos. Um, so I'm gonna to try to get those done Friday. I already know that I'm gonna be at home Friday night. Um, I'm not going off, or at least that's not the plan. And so I can put that in and be relatively um, for sure about what I'm doing there. And then I have um, another one of my words from the Plangineer Trash. I'm going to <clears throat> put that here. And then I have this strip, which is another one of those strips of stickers that I have no idea where they're from. Um, it does not have a name on it anywhere, but I'm just gonna pull one of these little trash cans. I think it's really cute and matches the color scheme here really well. So I can put that down. Um, let's see, was there anything else between, yes, okay. I am going to be uh, doing some cleaning this day. Um, I'm gonna swap the days that I normally do Izzy's bath on um, Thursdays, but I'm gonna hold off on that and this is just gonna be cleaning and I'm gonna put her on Wednesday and do my cleaning on Thursday. I've had to kind of flip flop those this week. So yeah, um, I'm gonna go ahead and put in the words that I know I can use. So we're gonna use uh, bathroom bathrooms, and then um, also dust and floors. And then anything after that, um, if I get it done, I'll write it in if I don't have a word. But that's gonna be my cleaning list for the day Thursday. Now, as far as this habit tracker that I put down, I am going to track my water, and I do have a Plangineer word for water here. I don't know, I, I just don't understand guys why in the world every time I go to film that it's necessary for the dogs to bark. <laughs> I don't understand, I just don't. Okay, um, one of the things that I need to do uh, tomorrow first thing is I need to go in and I need to see about getting, um, picking up my refills. I'm trying to find, I've got, this is from the Plangineer. She does like refills here and then she has the little individual um, little capsules or whatever. I'm just gonna pull one of these in this bright green and um, I will remember when I see that that I need to go pick up my refills that are at the pharmacy and waiting on me. And then I also have Happy Mail coming on this day and I have this from the Plangineer which also works. Um, really, I probably can use either of these, but I think I want to use this, this peachy color, even though um, I probably could use this in other spreads more easily. It'll show up better on that one. And then, uh, let's see here. Um, this is where I was going to put the Izzy sticker to um, remind myself that she's getting a bath on Wednesday instead of Thursday. So we have that. Okay, now the next thing I want to do is I want to go in with my half boxes and any of these littles that I can use. I'm not really sure how many of these I can really use. Um, I am gonna need to get in some, um, I have some dark clothes that I need to wash. Probably do, I'm gonna do it on this day. So I'm gonna do just laundry here. And then I'm going to put in my half box so that I can write in whatever I happen to get done YouTube-wise. And um, other than decoration, I think that's gonna be all that I really have to get done. All right, I may have to lower this one to get my sticker in because I got a feeling that that's gonna need to overlap, which is fine. I like, over, I like to overlap my stickers. 
so I really don't mind. So I'm going to put it here like that, and I'll put this down below like that, and it does overlap just a touch, but that's fine by me. I don't mind that at all. Okay, and then for this one, I will go in with, let's see, I've got one of those already, and that, I don't want to do that side by side, so let's just go in with this one, just like that, and um, probably, if I had to guess, I will probably, this is going to be, after I clean all day, I'm going to be tired, and I got a feeling I'm probably going to do some Netflix chilling and stuff like that on Thursday evening, so let's just put that in, and I'll go ahead and make the time for it, and that'll give me lots of extra energy for this day. Okay, so the only thing I have left, really, let me put this stuff away, is the, um, and, and like I told you, I really don't have a lot going on this week, but the things that I do have, I have marked. So I'm just gonna kinda go in with this deco. One of the things that I noticed that um, she does with her weekend banner is she puts some of the decorative stickers across the top and I have those to use and I'm going to go with these florals because I think they're perfect for that. So I'm going to just put those, she puts one on the corners and in the middle and this works perfectly for that. So I'm going to do that and I think it looks really cute. It is it's worth it, especially when you don't, I mean, I like, don't get me wrong, I like the planning process and that sort of thing. And when you have a week that it's more decorative than functional, then obviously it's a great week for that. But, okay, down here in this corner, um, there's the line showing and I have this deco here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just put this down like that and I'm gonna trim it off. See how cute that is? Um, it looks like it was just meant to be there um, because it is kind of hanging off just a bit. And now I have the rest of this deco to place and I want to um, find some really cute spots for this and I absolutely have to use this. I'm just not sure where I wanna use it at. I'm thinking about putting it here because I believe it'll show pretty well. Um, I could put it, that just, I may have to end up using some glue to make that lay down right there because it's just not sticky enough to lay down. Let's go ahead and peel it off and kind of put it some different places and see how it's gonna look. I mean, I love a, ta a good tassel banner and I think it's just adorable. And since um, I already have a weekend banner, I mean, I could put it at the bottom here, I guess, but it would cover up some of that washi. And I really do feel like that it will would be cute here. So let's just do it like that. Let's just do that and call it a day. That's adorable. That's just stinking cute. I love that. I like that a lot. Okay. I do want to use this large mug up here at the top because I do want to cover as much as that of that white out as I possibly can that I used. So we're gonna place that there. I think that's really cute. I've already used one of these cups up here for Coffee Monday, but there's another one that's just like it. And I think what I will do is put it down here. Um, let's put it during all of this work and stuff and such so that when I am planning and working, I can have a mug of coffee. I think it's just super, super cute. And I think that I want to use this and the scarf. I'm not sure I want to use the scarf, actually. But I do like the idea of this little steaming mug here. And I think that I might put it here. Just like that. That's really, really cute. And I do want to add the floral. Um, and I'm thinking, since I have this kind of trellis look here, I'm thinking that I might want to put it here like that. I think that's really cute. I, I mean, guys, it's hard for me to use a, a scarf knowing that it's 90 degrees all of this, <laughs> this entire week here. Um, so as of right now, what I have left is the scarf and two half boxes. Of course, I have these. 
and I am going to just cut this apart and put them in their places and then I have this leftover washi so um, once I have finished the week and I no longer am in need of any stickers to match this kit then I will obviously um, separate it out and put it into my sticker collection to use again I do like the little sampler that was part of this I just um, I don't see myself using it it's really cute this little deer here and the little foxes the, they're just cute but I don't think I'm gonna use them I'll just put them in with my um, with my samplers so guys that's it I think that I'm just gonna go with this yeah it was kind of talky and all that kind of stuff even though there's not a whole lot of functional going on, but you know, it took a long time to, to do this and to, you know, talk about it. And I hope you guys um, enjoyed watching me plan and rattle on um, about different things. Be sure to check out that Instagram account, Mandy Anxiously Plans, I believe it is. I have already put it on the screen for you, so I know that you, you know what it is at this point. But go ahead and check her account out. It's a really fun account to watch. Um, I like the way that she decorates her planner. And yeah, that's gonna be it. So I think we're going to um, take leave for the day. I hope you guys have a wonderful upcoming week. Um, happy fall, and I'll talk to you guys later. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up and hit subscribe on the way out if you would. Talk to you later, bye.